everyone, I'm hairstylist and makeup artist Amanda Shackleton and founder of Media Makeup Academy and I want to talk to you today about the idea of partnering a hair salon along with the makeup counter. I speak to a lot of my students about this. It's a great way when you're starting out as a makeup artist to get in with the salon and it's also a great way for the salon to have a makeup artist in the salon when clients are there, especially for events, for brides, for weddings, for things, uh, uh, New Year's Eve, any kind of party occasions. It's really nice when you can offer hair and makeup services to people that come in. And a lot of the time salons don't know what to do because they don't want to release their stylists that do hair maybe on a Saturday, which is their busiest day, so they don't have makeup artists at all. They want their hairstylists to be doing hair and not be doing makeup. So I think it's nice if you want to go into your local salons, if you're a makeup artist, and offer your services there. You can bring in your makeup kit, um, set it up, do clients makeup for free. Um, if they like it and they want to book you, they can book you on a freelance position, um, they can book you to come into the salon a couple days a week and eventually what you can do if it starts to work out is um, form your own brand of cosmetics. There's a lot of no-name cosmetic label companies out there and what they are basically are just warehouses and big factories that make kind of generic makeup and a lot of the makeup is really really good and you can go ahead and stamp your name on it and then you've got the makeup counter and you've got the salon, you're partnering together, you're offering more services, and it's better for everybody's budget. I'm hairstylist and makeup artist Amanda Shackleton.